Hey guys, I'm LB, and we are going to check out Pipe Zero Two Close Square Bracket Minus Portal Invariant by Indifferential. In the next test, Aperture Science notes the possible discouragement of test subject test subject name here while reminding that the cool breeze from Excursion Funnel is completely safe in most cases and hopefully will uplift test subject spirit. But you know the old formula, what goes up must come down, and you do have a weight of testing on your shoulders. Featuring testing elements, temporary portal device access, light bridges, faith plates, discouragement field, emancipation grill, a proximity-based emancipation grill for portals only, difficulty medium, and there are hints, thank you. Yes, I was told that this would have more puzzles focusing on the portal gun pedestals, where you can only ho have one portal gun at a time, and each portal gun shoots a different portal. I really like that in the last one. If you haven't seen the last one, you can- you can see me really be excited about it. Ah, uh, yes. And it seems that just like the- the, the previous one, we will be re this is our dual entrance and exit. We will be returning here with the portal gun to put on the pedestal, and that would allow us to leave. But yeah, the idea of temporarily holding a mono portal gun putting it down, walking around, taking up the other mono portal gun, and doing stuff with it. That is really fascinating to me. What do we have here? This is a cool visual. I can't even tell what I'm looking at, though. Oh, okay, I can kind of tell now, from moving around a bit. So, are those gears? What, is that... I think that's a funnel, actually. Yeah, I think that's a funnel emitter up there. The Enrichment Center reminds you that bold, persistent experimentation is the hallmark of good science. Why didn't that have any- any, uh, captions, I wonder? Eh, whatever. Hmm. What do we have around here, huh? Very unusual area. The background ambient sound is kinda creepy. Uh... <laughs> Why did you taunt me by turning the handle and then not opening the door? Oh, man. Alright, so... Can we turn this back off, I wonder? Oh, that switches the direction. Okay. Well, I think the only way to make progress is to go up here. What is that for? Oh, we're moving much faster now! I heard a fizzler turn on somewhere. Oh, now we're moving slower. Wait, how does the funnel move through this? What? The funnel is moving through... That doesn't make sense. Also, does this funnel seem larger than normal? Can you make them larger in Hammer? Maybe I'm imagining it. The funnel just seems larger. Well, that was weird. What was going on with the animation cycle there? But anyway, yeah. How is the funnel going through that? That doesn't make much sense, actually. Anyway... Ah, here we have main testing area, it would seem. We can see the puzzles we are going to be subjected to before actually being subjected to them. Nice. I see a pedestal! Ooh! Just so you know, I have to go give a deposition for an upcoming trial. In case that interests you. Test on your own recognizance. I'll be right back. I don't remember hearing that unused dialogue, but I don't think I listened to all the unused dialogue. This is strange. Ooh, I think this song is... Haunted Panels? I think that's what the song is. It's so quiet you can barely hear it! So unless you turn up your volume so loud that I'm basically shouting in your ears, you probably won't be able to hear it. I can hear it. But it's very faint. What's up there, I wonder? Hello, you are going to be destroyed. As soon as I get my hands on a portal gun. Oh yes, I remember how this works. Let's just look around a bit though. So here is a spot for us to put a cube and block the laser beam. That's kind of an interesting alternative to a button. So unless we're gonna get a laser cube and like, point it- Oh crap, let's not do that. So unless we're gonna get, get a laser cube, I'm not sure why you wouldn't just use a regular old button. What the? These antlines are tiny! Look how tiny that is! They're so tiny! Why are they so tiny? 
because that funnel seems larger than normal. These ant lines seem tinier than normal. So this is a dual player fizzler and object fizzler, it would seem. And portal fizzler, of course. We have the other portal gun here. Hmm, seems like when we use one or the other, it'll turn on the fizzler until we put it back. Here we can get a cube from somewhere, apparently. Oh! I see. Let me see that again, actually. Why does those other light bridges turn on? To prevent the cube from flying to either side, maybe? It must be to prevent some sort of exploit or unintended solution. Interesting mood lighting. Interesting indeed. Alright, well, let's just press the button and see what will happen here. <laughs> I happened to look away at just the right time. Wait, what? That wasn't- what? Really? So now that I've pressed one of the buttons, the player fizzler is on, but not the object and portal fizzler. And then when I take the portal gun, the player fizzler turns off and the object and portal fizzler turns on. Huh. Oh. Really now? How am I supposed to activate both portals at once? If I do that... Can't have them on opposite sides? Huh. Oh no, I can! Here we go. This is how I do it. There we go! That's what I wanted to do. You're mine now. And you are going... I wonder if I can actually break the map this way. <laughs> yeah, you might want to fix that. I think I've actually broken this a little bit, but uh... There we go. That's what I wanted to have happen. Right. So... What exactly did I want to do? Right, I know what I want to do. Do that. Alright, and then I need to actually take this. Ah, I said take, take, thank you. And then now the question is, well, my core is gonna get cleared if I walk through there anyway, so I might as well just, you know, see what's up here. Yeah, it's probably to prevent me from grabbing the cube from this ledge if I had to guess. That's a tiny target. Although, what else would I use to grab the cube? This question. I could jump down here. Oh, that's what the tiny target's for. So we can get back up whenever. I think they kind of overshot a little bit, but that's okay. Interesting. Uh huh. I see. Oh crap, let's pretend that I didn't just do that. <laughs> okay, that works, I suppose. I guess that is technically one way. I didn't have to throw the cube, I could've taken it with me, but no- who cares? I didn't break the puzzle. 
So... Also, what is up with that? You can almost see... What is that? Is that an easter egg? Oh yeah, there's like a... a turret and a disc lamp in there. Half a turret? It's cut in half! Interesting. Right, so now that we have this cube... I suppose we could just go ahead and block the laser and see what that does for us. Huh. That inverts how it works? Yes, indeed it does. Is there anywhere I want to portal to around here? No, that is a player and object fizzler. Yeah, we don't want to touch the player and object fizzler, that'll just kill us. Yeah, nothing around here of interest, other than the strange portal 1 lighting. Did this ever turn on? Was this on at some point and I just didn't pay attention? <laughs> you might, uh, you might want to add a back texture to that, my friend. Although the collision's good, so nice work on that. Right, so where do we actually want to go, and why do I no longer have any music? Wait, the light bridge is on permanently now? When did that happen? Does it know that I got the cube? Oh, look at that, I... <laughs> I wonder what would happen if you timed it just right to drop a cube at the same time as something was going through there. Wonder if they're on prescripted paths or if they would actually collide. It looks like they're on prescripted paths, but anyway. I don't think there's a way to get back down the funnel just yet, so we don't need to worry about that. Why do I want the cube to be like that? Why do I care about this happening the way things have happened? I don't see what that does for me, to be honest. Hang on a minute. No, I can't portal up there. Okay. I was gonna consider trying to get up there to see if anything was up there, but I don't think I can get up there. Ah, there's nothing of interest. Got it. But anyway, let's take this cube, and I'm thinking maybe... Maybe I don't need to take it here yet. Maybe it's for later. So I go back over here. Yeah, how are we gonna get up there? Oh, well, that's clever. Intentionally covered up the portal surfaces to prevent you from just strafing onto the ledge there. Nice work. Right, well, maybe let's try putting the cube on the button and see if that gets us anything. Come on. <laughs> I do find it strange that the light bridge is just permanently on now. It's changed to a check mark. And I can't even- can't even press this button anymore. It is locked. That is a locked button, if I ever saw one. That turns on a fizzler. What else does it do? It does... this. Okay.
<laughs> oh, Valve. I collide with the water as I go through the portal. Congratulations, Valve, you have a buggy game. Hmm... I think I can sort of... get an idea of what I need to do here. If... I... Oh, I actually wanted to be on there with, uh, hmm. Actually, this works. Yeah, this actually kinda works a little bit better than what I was expecting. No, 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 actually. Uh... Yeah, I need to go through here. Portals you don't own don't get fizzled. Good, that seems to be aim-assisted. Perfect. So then... I can do this. Gimme- give gimme give the... gun. There we go. Right. Now... Theoretically... Uh-huh... Now what? Why is... what is this for? It's just... is this just to hide a portal service so that I can't... Cause obviously I can't make this at an angle. What the? <laughs> um... I could actually shoot that from that platform, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> oh wow, that's... that's... Amazing job, Valve. I think you did an excellent job with the portal surface detection code, Valve. I think Hugo B. Designer would be, um, absolutely amazed to learn how you actually made the portal detection code. Because he's making a game and he, he needs to make portal detection code. Portal surface detection code, I mean. Stunning work, Valve. Ace. How did I... <laughs> oh, man. That's great. Oh, what the... <laughs> that freaks out the game so badly. Alright, well, enough of that. That just does that. Um... This isn't enough to get me up onto the light bridge, right? Well, yeah, because I, I hit my head on it, so... I don't think I can keep my portal in there, though. How would I do that? You know, I never have considered pressing that button until just now. Maybe- maybe that would make things a lot easier. That probably would make things a lot easier. Let's, uh... I can get back over here quite easily, so, yeah. Let's- let's see what happens upon pressing that button. Also, I wanna see what this does. Whee! And it doesn't even turn on the light bridges for me. Only the cube. Interesting. Is that permanent? Yes, that's permanent. I- why didn't I do that a long time ago? <laughs> oh man, that... wow. Oh, that's why I want the cube there. That would allow me to walk through here. Oh... What happens if I call the cube again? Wouldn't be able to get it over there anyway. Not from here. What does that light mean? That one's white, that one's yellow. Or maybe it's supposed to be orange, but you can clearly see... 
that they're a different shade, so... Go up here. Doesn't do it much. Do as much good, does it? Can I get rid of the camera? Ha! Yes. Camera destroyed. I didn't even realize that that was a portal surface. But I guess that is. It just looks different. It's dirtier. It's dirtier, but it's a portal surface nonetheless. All right. Well, we can easily get rid of this guy. Um. Yeah, I'll do that. That works. Ta-da! Camera eliminated. Alright, back we go. Interesting. Come on, surely I should be able to portal under there. Yeah, I can. Okay, um... Because as soon as I take the cube off the button, I'll lose the black portal and I'll have to redo a bunch of stuff. So it's really in my best interest to keep the cube on the button. Yeah, and that- that just hits me head first into this light bridge that I can't turn off. Notice those light bridges are at a slight angle. That's- that's cute. Neat little detail. But not helpful in the current situation. Uh... I didn't have another cube, right? There's no way I'm tossing the cube over there. Actually, how do I get back over there? Ah, oh, that's what the light bridges are for on the edges, to keep it from falling off when you recall it. Um... Yeah, I don't have any portals open right now, so... How do I get back? Right, I just have to take the portal gun. That's the issue. Then it'll clear my portal that's over there. Hmm. Of course, the crosshairs don't update, because Valve never considered mono portal puzzles. Again and see what all we can do with it. I wonder if the light bridge is triggered this way as well. Oh, <laughs> it hit me on the head. Oh, come on now. Oh, come on now. I just wanted. To, I just want to test this. I want to test this theory. No, it's only when you press the button. Interesting. 
Uh. Right, so let's take the cube back from whence it came. I think the best way would be to do it this way. There we go. Excuse me, game, I would like to pick up my cube, thank you. That inverts the behavior. I'm still amazed that I made a portal land there somehow. Like, Team Spins explained to me that it only checks- HA! <laughs> yeah, you totally can do that! That is definitely an exploit that is 100% possible. And it's all Valve's fault! It is all Valve's fault. Maybe if you don't want the player to put portals there, then just don't make it portalable. <laughs> yes. Well. Right, so we can respawn the cube to get it out of there to this side, if we wanted to. Oh, I can't quite- Oh, there I can. Yeah. I can fit through the portal if I crouch. Definitely not supposed to be able to do that. Mm hmm. Hmm. Maybe if we pre-place our portal... Cause we can get up onto this light bridge and we can jump onto it... from right here. And then we can walk onto the other light bridge and walk to there. That might work. Potentially. But I think we would want to use the other portal to do it, so... We do that. I saw something flying through the air, but it was just flying through the tubes. We do that, and then walk over here. Then we can easily get back over there with the green port. Yes, I think this should theoretically work. I can do this. Take this with me. I can put it on here. This is aim assisted, don't have to worry about that. That allows me to get into here. Now the question is... How do I get into there now? I suppose I could just try and get the cube in here, right? But then, that wouldn't make much sense. Maybe I did want this the other way around with the portals. No, maybe I I'm, I'm a bit confused here. So I can put the cube in there, but that's about all I can do. Oh my gosh, find a place in there. It just doesn't want to be in there. Come on, I know there's more room than that. 
Fine, maybe that's not intended and it's intentionally scripted to do that. <laughs> yeah, no, that's... I'm pretty sure it's not supposed to work that way. Huh. Clearly that's not gonna work. So, let's try setting things up a different way. Oh, it didn't work that time! It didn't work that time! Yeah, well, that's what happens when you have physics in a puzzle game. Again? Really, Valve? Are you serious right now, Valve? Also, whatever I just did with the portal was crazy. There we go. That's more like it, Valve. Behave. We invert this fizzler. Something. Yes, I think I see... ...sort of what I need to do. Oh, come on, let me pick up the gun. There we go. Bit of a picky trigger. Let's try this. Wait, hmm... I want to pre-place my green portal, but I want to switch to the black portal afterwards. And that's... a bit of an issue. Do I even need the light bridge to do that? Am I... Am I overcomplicating things? Can I do something slightly different? Can I, like, just fling up here? Am I... am I overcomplicating things here? I might be. Maybe I could just fling up there the whole time and I didn't even know it. Ah, oh, crap. So I, I, I can fix this. I need this gun, though. I need the, the green gun. There we go. Wait, no... Oh 
my gosh, I'm so confused. <laughs> uh... Yeah, I actually do need the black gun. Ah, I just messed myself up again. This is a tricky puzzle. Here we go, this is what I wanted. And then maybe I need to take the cube now. And... I don't know, leave it there? Perhaps? Because the physics is not even gonna be on. Yeah, that works. Why did I do that a long time ago? Because I'm the king of overcomplicating. Trying to do it with the light bridge. Much more complicated. Something of the Spheres is the name of this song, I believe. Also very quiet. What has this accomplished for me, though? I don't actually know what this has accomplished. Maybe just the ability to use the light bridge over there? And all it did was turn off this scissor, though. I'm a bit confused. What did I just accomplish? Hey, I can shoot portals through there? <laughs> um... I don't understand what I accomplished. What am I standing on? I can actually get over here? Kinda. Yeah, I can actually get over here. Who knew? Let's pretend I didn't do that. Maybe I'm supposed to leave the cube on the button? Maybe it'll make more sense in that case? Um... I don't know. I'll do that, perhaps? And then maybe... But... But... In order to get back here with the green portal... gun... Mmm... I... don't know what I accomplished. I really don't. I really don't know what I accomplished. I have no idea, to be honest. Now I can't get back over there. I can shoot name assisted portal there, but that, that doesn't do me much good. Like, hooray, I have a light bridge. <laughs> um I 
Was I, like, shoot, was I supposed to shoot a portal there or something? Somewhere else? Well, I don't even understand what I'm doing. The funnel's reversed now. But, no, no, the funnel's always been reversed. Is that- I'm supposed to do that? You want me to do that? How's that supposed to work? Couldn't I always do that? What? Oh, come on. That was so close. Oh, come on now. Don't be that way with me. No, that still doesn't work. That is- there's no way that's enough. That is not- that is not right. Oh, this is- this is some glass, apparently. Didn't even... Yeah, that po I suppose that would be glass. It just looks so transparent here. Do you guys know birds can't see glass? I haven't actually seen that movie, by the way. I just know that that line is from the trailer. What do you want from me? <laughs> um... I can shoot my green portal anywhere I want over here and then switch to black portal, but I can do that from the beginning! I could always do that from the beginning. What's changed? I don't... I really don't see... what I've done or accomplished here. What was the big significant thing of turning this fizzler off? Cause I can't go back through that way. I've already pressed the button. I really don't understand what I've accomplished, cause I, like, I could always set this up from the beginning. Was I supposed to take the cube with me? Is that what's going on here? At least we got the Haunted Panels music back. I'm still not entirely sure... ...that I understand. Oh right, I need to... I need to switch to the Black Portal Gun first. Accomplishing. Oh, hey, careful, don't do that. Hooray, I guess? <laughs> Still don't understand quite why that's an accomplishment, but I'll take it, I guess. And then maybe this time I'll take the cube with me, even though I think I could have had the cube in both portals over there from the start. Who knows, maybe- maybe I'm accomplishing something without even realizing it. Oh, come on. Come on. Nope, nope. There we go. If I take this, put this on here, and then shoot a portal somewhere... Like, uh, I don't know, there, maybe? get the green portal gun, though. Right, 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 right. I'll just put the cube there ahead of time. Just grab the green portal gun, go through, and then I can always grab the black portal gun if I decide I need that instead. Haha! <laughs> Light it up here again.
like, am I supposed to shoot a portal there at the last second or something? I'm not clear on the concept. Can I just put the cube up here? Will that do anything for me? There. You stay there, cube. Also, these are some sharp edges! Look at these sharp edges! I'll poke your eye out! Right. Uh... I'm not entirely sure I know what I'm doing, but clearly I'm doing something. I just have to assume that what I'm doing is correct. Close. Close. Um... Well, I suppose this is one way, but... <laughs> this is not quite what I had in mind. Um... Crap. Okay, I can make that jump. <laughs> it's worth a shot. Um... Clearly I need to aim better, it would seem. Want for me, game? Indifferential. I'm having a bit of a struggle here. Oh my gosh. Come on, that was so close. Come on. I just want to stand in the actual portal. Is that so wrong? There we go. Oh no, that's not. No, no. There we go. Come on, that was so close! Finally! I have no idea if that's what I'm supposed to do. And I'm pretty sure I could have done that at the beginning without needing to turn that off, but... Who knows? Is this gonna do anything for me? Wait, you're telling me I need to have the cube on something? Oh wait, now this is open. Is that what I did? I opened this, I didn't even- okay, that's what pressing the button did, I guess. I guess that was just a shortcut to get back to the start, even though it wasn't necessary. Is this a dual portal device? Yes, it is a dual portal device! Okay then. I guess the portal's up here just in case you forgot the cube. <laughs> I like that sign. That's a funny sign. What do we have here? Anything of interest? Not really, just some decoration. Decorative decoration. There we go. Wait. This funnel moves very slowly, and then it moves very quickly, and then it'll move very slowly. Oh, not right this second. What is this area? Have I even seen this area? Did I miss this? How did I miss this? This is the whole area that I missed. What the? <laughs> what? Uh... Oh my... What? How is that... How does that image even exist? What even is that image? That's a picture of the cube on the light bridge? What? <laughs> uh... Teamspin, can you explain that? What exactly... 
I mean, I know that's the bottom side of the surface of the water, but why is that image there? That's not even where I saved the game. I don't think I'm supposed to see that. Like, something tells me that the water is not supposed to look like that. Maybe. Maybe it is. Maybe Indifferential was going for that kind of look. But I just have this feeling that maybe it's not supposed to be that way. supposed to do that? Like, there's a whole area that I haven't been to yet. I've been back to, like, there's a place I can put the cube and stuff. Can I just hop through here? Yeah, I can just jump through. Um... What is this area? What? Appears to be solid. Um... Hmm... Where am I? What is even going on? <laughs> um... Wait, is this... I can access that from the lower area? Also, that- that doesn't quite look right. That- <laughs> Um... I'm so confused! What is even happening right now? I feel like I've broken this map somehow. Something tells me I've done something wrong. What is that? Ooh, that thing has numbers on it! Actually, no it doesn't, but I'm just... ...quoting... ...something from Portal 1. How do I get up on any of those? I don't even think I'm supposed to be there. I think this is all decorative. How do I- maybe I wasn't even supposed to be able to get out of here. Oh no, my cube! Oh! Ah! It just fills with my portals. Okay, good. Wait a sec. Could I just leave? I have unfinished business, though. survived. That's interesting. I guess I should have factored in your weight. Well, I'll be here during the whole next test. Oh, you stole my gun from me! Right. I have no idea how much of what I did was actually necessary. Because I still feel like... Like, what would have happened if I come here before putting the cube there? Because this is connected, right? Yeah. I'm confused. I think I'll just let Indifferential explain some things to me, because... Yeah. <laughs> anyway, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I will see you all in another video. Goodbye!